so here we go with my weekend planning routine. I always start with my meal plan. So here I'm just planning out breakfast for the week, lunch, dinner, snacks, snacks for Levi. And then here I pulled up the computer because I'm, I want to have salads this week, but I was trying to find different ingredients to kind of change it up a little bit, but I ended up making basically the same salad I eat all the time. This looks like a hot mess, but this is this is exactly what I need. It's just a blank piece of paper to kind of map out our meals for the week and then make a grocery list. And here I'm just looking at my planner to kind of get some ideas for dinner. This is why I always say save your meal plans or have them somewhere that you can get to them because they help tremendously. That's what that other piece of paper is as well as an old meal plan and it helps me create a new meal plan. Then down here at the bottom, I'm just making a grocery list. And then on the back of this sheet, I'm writing out everything that I need to food prep for the week so I can get all of my food and meals and stuff ready to go. And I just take that sheet to the kitchen with me once I start meal prepping and I just check off things as I go. And here it is. This was uh, this week's meal plan. Okay, next up, I'm gonna start planning in my nursing school and catch-all planner. And I always start with this get it done sheet and I use this as basically a way to brainstorm everything that I need to get done for the week. And I use that in conjunction with the monthly spread to make sure I'm not forgetting exams or quizzes or anything else we have going on. So I actually had a totally different idea for a spread that I wanted to do for this week. And then I started flipping through sticker books and I seen those little like rainbow striped stickers and I was like, oh my gosh, that would make a cute spread. I'm gonna start with those and so I did and I just scrapped my original idea, which I still wanna do. And then I decided to, to make this spread. Do you guys ever do that? Let me know in the comments if you guys ever start with an original idea and then you completely scrap it because of one sticker or maybe a couple of stickers and you're like, oh, this would be so cute if I put these together. Okay, so now that I've got all the stickers down, I just start filling in everything. And these little um, hexagon and triangle stickers is where I put like the priorities of the day is the blue ones and then the yellow ones are like important. So um, my exams, that kind of thing, my clinical. And then the left side, I have this broken down into a to-do list, which is just a general to-do list, a nursing to-do list, and then that little flag sticker underneath of that is the things that I write down for clinicals. You are exactly where you need to be. I absolutely love that sticker. And here's the sticker books I used. Mainly Womankind, I used Encouragement, and then also the super cute, awesome, totally amazing sticker book is one of my favorites. And I'll actually be using that sticker book for my next spread, which you'll see here. This is my social media and fitness planner. It was originally just social media, but I've added fitness into it now, so I have a little bit more room. And I just have pre-cut insert sheets that go over top of the um, pink blocks. I cover those up because if it's pink, I feel like that kind of dictates the colors I can use in the spread, and I don't like that. So I always cover them up, and then that, um, that just kind of lets me create the spread I want, use whatever colors I want. And I love this sticker book, you guys, for social media. So I just plan out my daily Instagram post and then my filming or editing schedule is over there as well. And I didn't film this part, but I wish I would have. I add my workouts in there as well. And then um, I also add meals over here to the left side. I'll show you an after the pin picture here in just a second. Again, I only use this sticker book. If you're a newbie planner and you're like, I want a sticker, what sticker book should I get? I definitely recommend this one. So here's an after the pin spread and you can see on the left side, I did lunch and snacks um, for my meals and wrote in my workouts. And then here's the after the pin for my nursing school and catch all planner. And that's it guys, that's my, that's my weekend planning routine. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.